Yeah, these are the ones that bite. Oh, really? These are the ones that bit the uh, friends that I had. Oh, really? Yeah, Ooh. come on. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, why is he looking at me? Oh, jeez. Oh, scared me. My name is Dharma. I am the butler or curator at Kumana Bali. And before we continue for the check-in process, we have the Balinese welcome ritual. Oh. We call it as a three dab two bracelet, oh. the symbol of the protection and good luck in Bali. Doesn't matter which one. Uh, the right oh, hand right it will one. be great. As you can see, this bracelet has three colors: oh. red meaning the bravery, white for the good spirit, and black for the protection. Oh wow! The symbol of the Balinese flower. Oh, Kiss. oh thank you. You're welcome. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, this is the lemon oh. cake uh, oh. for the drink is lemonade uh, orange juice mixed with uh, water, uh, coconut water thank you so much and also the opening hours are here you can mm -hmm. have to look here welcome oh uh, yes welcome to Manabali. bye bye Welcome to Umana Bali. Gonna give you a room tour of this incredible resort. Starting in this spacious living room, you have enough room to seat six people easily. We're gonna swing around and look at the monkey. <laughs> Kyle is not the biggest fan, but I am obsessed. We had about 10 on our roof this morning. They do start to get a little pack animal feel. So you do get a little nervous. They did say don't leave any food or any items for that matter outside and make sure you lock your doors. I guess they can be a little aggressive. So we felt it a little bit, but I'm obsessed with monkeys. So and he just keeps coming closer. So I love it. The kitchen. We've got, by the way, these are real flowers, which I again can't even understand this kitchen huge kitchen you get six waters to start with you can brush your teeth with the water but they said not to drink it so you dial zero for your personal butler let me say that again personal butler and you get water rides on a golf cart to wherever you want to go so again this is the kitchen you have your bottle opener ice bucket you have alcohol up here at the top for purchase as well as snacks and then you have more alcoholic beverages down below, wine cellar, and then there's some beer down there and a few sodas. But again, these are for purchase, but they do give you as much water as you need. He's right by the door. Oh, look at, oh my gosh, he wants it so bad. I just want to give him a hug. Oh, I cannot even believe this. Oh, <laughs> Oh man. Brief interruption for the incredible monkey sighting. This hallway into the powder room. And again, those views. So you can sit on that toilet and look out to this magnificent view. So a really cool feature. It is, it opens, but I closed it. So it's, okay. So everything is controlled remotely here, except for the blinds or the curtains which ugh, we have to get up and do it ourselves. <laughs> First four problems. Huge vanity to get ready, ladies. Going into the bathroom, this gigantic bathroom. It's so big, it echoes. You have your double vanity here, huge mirrors. You have amenity kits here, bathtub, which is one of our personal favorites. We can easily fit probably three or four people in here. Not that we would because that's weird, but they included candles, incense, 
bath salts. Are you kidding me? Soap. I think this is some kind of like lemongrass. It smells so good. Conditioner, body wash, shampoo. I also want to find out what, oh, it doesn't say it on here. Oh, wow. These are so heavy. Heavy. Um, oh, funny. Essen essence of patchouli. I guess I'm starting to like the smell of patchouli. I used to hate it because it smelled like the bums uh, in Santa Cruz downtown. I'm starting to love it. Can't forget this. Outdoor shower. Oh, and then you can walk to the pool from the outdoor shower. <laughs> Nuts. Absolute bonkers. Moving on. And now the throne. So it is motion censored and seat heated. Amazing. And then we've got the rain forest shower up ahead and then the handheld shower, which is nice. In case you don't want to get your hair wet, ladies. Now, a nice place to Put your suitcase or any extra storage that you need. You've got huge cubbies down below. And then you've got, again, lots of storage space. And then this is awesome. We signed up for 7.30 a.m. yoga. You have to reserve a spot a day in advance. So they provide you that yoga mat. And then they also provide you a beach bag, which is so cool. So you can take this down to the pool, beach. You don't get to keep it, but you get to use it while you're here. I will definitely be taking advantage of these. I think this is such a great touch. Yeah, you get two different hats. <laughs> and then a safe, which we'll never use because it's so, so safe here. Everyone's so sweet. They would never steal. Moving on to the bedroom, which is ah! every single view is stunning. King size bed. We have our robes laid out for us, as well as our slippers. And there is ample air conditioning, which we were a little worried about because it is pretty warm outside. So we heard some mixed reviews on how the air conditioning worked. The doors do have to be closed for the air conditioning to work, so remember that. Uh, but it works so well. The bed is nice and firm, which has been the best sleep for us. The pillows are thick, but they poof down. So they're not, they don't hurt your neck at all. So that's been glorious. We had a great sleep last night. And then you have this Chase lounge chair here to sit and just enjoy the water. You can hear that waterfall out there, which is insane. The TV, you can choose your in-room dining. They'll bring you your breakfast and you can eat it in the pool. They have a tray that floats so you can eat it in the pool. They can set up activities too, helicopter rides, painting, lots of things, coffee tasting. So it is an extra charge, but if you wanna do any kind of activity excursion, they'll set that up for you. And then there's a whole buffet. I know, I might just go get something to... I will too once I order. Something, something in my stomach. This is insane. Tub -tub. Oh, 
Oh, this is one I think I ordered. Oh, sorry. <laughs> All right, getting a ride to the fitness center and spa. Nice little boutique and spa. Evening. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wait, is there another pool? Two pools? Let's break down the value of staying at Umana Bali. This hotel costs 90,000 Hilton Honors points per night. To put that into perspective, that's the same number of points you'd use for a Hampton Inn in New York City. And here, you're getting an entirely different level of experience. For those points, or roughly $800 in cash, you're getting access to a luxurious five-star retreat. Breakfast is included, and it's far beyond your standard buffet. It's a feast with made to order options to start your day right. The gym is fully equipped and overlooks beautiful gardens and yoga classes are included, held in a peaceful studio designed for focus and relaxation. And then there's the spa. This isn't just any spa. You'll have access to a sauna, a steam room, and even a cold plunge pool, all included in your stay. Now, here's the kicker. If you sign up for the Hilton Aspire card, you can earn a current welcome bonus of 150,000 Hilton Honors points after meeting the minimum spend. That's enough for almost two nights here at Umana Bali. I'll leave our referral link below if you're interested in signing up and snagging that bonus. When you compare what you get here to the alternatives for the same price or points, it's clear that Umana Bali is an exceptional deal. Oh, perfect. Cold plunge. Five degrees. Uh. <laughs> Do you go off and just sit in it or? As we arrived at Umana Bali, the beauty of the grounds immediately drew us in. The property is a tranquil haven with lush tropical landscaping and stone pathways that invite exploration. The main pool is a stunning centerpiece with a sleek infinity edge and surrounded by elegant loungers and shaded seats. The area feels calm and secluded, offering a perfect retreat to relax and unwind. The reception area sets the tone for the experience. It's completely open air with towering ceilings and natural materials that blend seamlessly with the environment. The intricate Balinese details in the woodwork and decor are balanced by modern touches, creating a welcoming and sophisticated space. Upon arrival, we were greeted with refreshing welcome drinks and cool towels, a thoughtful gesture that was much appreciated after our journey. One of the highlights of the property is Oliveira, the resort's signature restaurant. Overlooking the ocean, Oliveira offers an upscale dining experience in a refined yet relaxed setting. The design features high-end finishes and an inviting ambiance that perfectly complements the breathtaking views. The cuisine here is a carefully curated mix of Mediterranean-inspired dishes with a focus on fresh, locally sourced ingredients. Think grilled seafood, handmade pastas, and vibrant salads paired with an impressive selection of wines and cocktails. Oh, thank you. Sorry. Thank you so much. Oh, I thought it was going to be warm. There you go. That smells really good. All right. Oh, the flame was hot. Thank you so much. Yeah,
Uh, what happened? Uh, let's do one of each. That'd be great. Oh. One of each. <laughs> In wild. In wild. Uh, um. oh, <laughs> yeah, that's where we looked out. Wait, 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 wait. Yes. Yeah. We're gonna. Is that better? <laughs> Is it any better? Why are you doing this? Oh my gosh! What is wrong with you? Did you camera? move it? <laughs> I'm doing a pan up. Oh, if you move, move if you move at all, I don't move at move. all. <laughs> Do I look? I, you look good on everyone, Donna. Okay. It's We're at Olivera for dinner, and we are ordering a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so pretty. We got namuz bouche, salmon, tater tot, <laughs> and a. Nice, what is that, Pepsi? What is that? Like a fritter? It was a salmon. I would say quiche. I think she said. Was it? Oh. There's a flower on this. Oh, and that. There's a flower on the There's a little cheese in there. Getting to Umana, Bali was straightforward. We flew in from Singapore, a quick two and a half hour flight to Bali's Nagara Rai International Airport, commonly known as Denpasar Airport or DPS. From there, the hotel is about a 40 minute drive. We used Grab, which cost us around 20 US dollars, offering a convenient and affordable way to get here. Alternatively, you can arrange a transfer through the hotel or use local taxis. But we found Grab to be both reliable and cost effective. Sorry, one more time. So, our specialty for the South Asian cuisine. Okay. So, most of the la carte menu is South Asian food. But so, we mix with the chili sambal, but it is just slightly spicy. Okay. And then, okay. coming with the bitter nut cracker, we call it amping. Mush it out. Cone of silence. A cone of rice. <laughs> What'd you do? I did a scoop of this. Not. It's spicy. Oh, not where it's at. It's like, you add it sparingly. Beware. Mm. That's good though. That wraps up our stay at Umana Bali, a resort that truly redefines luxury with its incredible value and thoughtful details. From the stunning grounds and top tier amenities to the unforgettable dining at Oliveira. This is a destination that delivers far more than just a place to stay. Whether you're redeeming points or paying cash, it's a retreat that's worth every penny. If you're considering a trip to Bali, make sure this place is on your list. Don't forget to check out the links below for more details and our Hilton Aspire Card referral link to make the most of your travels. Until next time, stay curious. Love you guys.